I always feel like I have to fill the silence. Here, I'll grab. She I dance. I feel like we could do it now. Are you totally? I mean, if you want to, totally. I just do it to like make sure. Oh, I got an ad. We're good. Okay. Okay. Hey, friends. Happy Wednesday, friends day. I am so happy you're here with me today. We're going to paint this cute little cardinal. I painted one. I finished this earlier today. We're going to paint another one. The reference photo is on Pixabay. It's uh, courtesy of G.I. Jane. She, she fall, she's one of our crew. That's a good way to put it. She's one of the crew. A bestie. So this link, link to this photo is in this video's description. Emily's here with me tonight. Hello. We're going to grab the phone awkwardly and fly over to my art table. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. I should almost do like a trust fall to see how fast <laughs> you're able to grab it. You should. <laughs> And I'll like pull up. Does not it. tell you how fast I'm pulling. I'll twist a knee or drop. something. These cords, I like them overall. Okay, let me scoot my. Oh, wrong way. Wrong <laughs> way. Sorry, guys. People are staring at the. You're looking at the ceiling. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, what's goodness. that thing on there? Oh, it's telling me. Hang on. Oh, there. You go. Oh, there. We had an issue there. I don't know if you guys had an issue on your end. Okay. It's our first live. <laughs> That's funny. I was so worried about the camera, I wasn't paying attention to how I was putting it in there. I think we're, you can see it on my iPad. Shake out the quartz. Shake, shake, shake. Okay. 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 So I have a five by five inch cradled wood panel from US Art Supply, inch and a half thick. I put clear gesso on it a couple days ago. I have the colors listed in this video's description, but we'll run through them quick. I never, I never know where to put things. I don't think I need this. I've got that up on my bulletin board. Okay. Titanium white, phthalo blue green shade, Cad yellow medium hue. Oh, I've got too much. I put sprayed it too much. Oh. See the puddling? Quinacridone magenta. Mars black. I was spraying it some with this uh, palette wetting spray, which I which I think I don't know, is matte medium thinned out. But I think I went a little too crazy because hmm. I've got a puddle, or else it's, I was, I'm still Maybe using bleeding. water. Yeah, it's bleeding. I'm it's. <laughs> Things are falling. Uh, I'm also still using water. Let's just do that. And I'm going to want that moisture in a little bit. Okay, so the background I used, I've been, I used a lot of the same brushes and then I toss them and go on to something new. But I use this, oh, am I wearing it off? Three quarter inch flat brush from Royal and Royal. <laughs> I always think of gravy now. And Lang Nickel. And this is a sweeping sky, but in yellow. And then I mixed the green. Oh, this is the wrong palette. <laughs> this is the wrong palette. Oh, this is, I think this is the mushroom palette. <laughs> that is. That's the mushroom color. Oh, hi, Freckle. Oh, and Freckle showed up. Is it this one down here? Nope. Oh. Nope, nope. I switched. Oh, and you moved. This is why I wait, because you're on my cord. Oh. Oh, like feet? Like your chair. Oh, it is? Mm-hmm. Here you go. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Frank. How are you? Hi. How are you? I thought I switched to the right palette. Hi. Clearly, I did not. I think so. I think it's the same colors. Although, that might have been phthalo blue on the last palette. There we go. Hi, friend. This looks better. Phthalo blue green shade. Uh, what was I going to say? So now I didn't need to soak up that moisture. That would eventually get evaporated in the paints on that other palette. I don't know, think that there's anything I need to say. It's the same color. Phthalo blue green shade, Phenacridone <laughs> magenta, Mars black, titanium white, and Cad yellow medium hue. Oh, yeah. Uh, I use It's a sweeping sky. You could look at my um, How to Paint Clouds video. It's the most popular video if you go under that category. So, but I just used yellows and greens and a little bit of white. <laughs> I hope you guys can hear oh that. Oh my gosh. So sometimes freckles yawns and meows at the same time as it sounds like her battery is winding down. 
Um, that's the green I use for the background right here. It's a, just a pinch of thalo. You can. <laughs> can you? <laughs> Quite a bit of yellow, a little bit, and some white. Oh, you can. I use the photo as a traceable. Hi, bro. Scribbled on the back of the photo with chalk pastel. And then traced it with a ballpoint pen. I got some things going because I am not a fast painter. But here you can see my first efforts. I'm going to have the light here. It's not quite that dramatic in the photo, but we're going to do that. And then the only other brushes I think I've used are this little, oh, it's bigger than a quarter inch, Filbert. It says number 10 on there. It used to, oh, I think it still says it, Zhu, Z-H-U, Ting. I got them on Amazon. They're really cheap. I, the, the handles always crack and peel pretty fast. And then I've been using a number four round from Princeton. Okay, I'm just going to work on this cardinal. Everything happened at once. I did. Come here, Freckles. Come <laughs> Hope on. you guys are having a good day today. Let's see, where am I going to start? I mean, I might just grab this angle brush. I just grab brushes sometimes, not because they're the perfect one, just because it calls to me. This is a 3 eighths, 3 eighths inch from Royal and Lang Nickel. But I think it'll be nice for the, for the branch. Hey, Freckles, did you decide to come join the party? Mm-hmm. Let's see here. So far tonight, no, I guess I'll do this. In the chat, we have Deborah, Cindy, Gail, Shelley, Lucinda, Leanne, and Vanetta. Hey guys, thank you for coming. And uh, I think and it might be Vanita, honey. Did Vanita, we do that? okay. And did Vanita, we do that? Vanita can let us know. We, I think we did that. One I think I've done time. that. Yeah. And um, Vanita said, "What a sweet kitty." Sounds a bit demanding at the moment. Oh uh, yeah. Yes. We talked about tortitude. She's a torty. A medium hair, it's, I think, overall, mm -hmm. torty um, with a lot of attitude. I put a little white in my brown just to make it more opaque. And come back and... You'll have to go back and listen to the... The brow. Wow. Yep. When your battery power is off. Hi. That's not the first time she's done that. It's just funny it when she so does. It was so loud. It caught it, yeah. Yeah. So silly. Someone, I think it was in the Annie Tro Art Friends Facebook group, was excited because they mixed a brown. <laughs> Browns are tricky though. Yeah, I always just use an orangey, put black, a little bit of black in it. Mm -hmm. And then you could make it more yellow by adding yellow or make it more rusty by adding red. Well, and like, I mean, technically like the you can use out of the tube. We had, yeah. Sorry. But like for our art class, we always had to mix the complement to make the brown. Oh, that can be tricky. Um, and it's not, yeah, and not all of the complements make a good brown. No, and it depends on the paint brands. That too, yeah. I knew her plate spin. Hopefully I'm in, yeah, I'm in frame. Mm -hmm. I painted the toes blue just to have different colors. In the bird, painted the tail different colors. I'm going to glaze over it with some quinacridone. We're happy. We're happy. Well, you came in and she didn't want anything to do with you. No, she was in her little roll on the sofa, and I, I said hi, and I talked to her, and she just stared at me. That's what she does to me. She just stared at me like I was being bothered, <laughs> like I was being a bother. You were. I was. But now she wants me. She's funny. Oh, I hear... Oh, am I hearing you or is there something in my office? I think there's something in your office. You want me to go turn it off? Yeah, I thought... I I mean... Yeah. Well, I don't know. I don't think it's going to pick up. Yeah, I'll wait and see if Freckle leaves. Otherwise yeah. she'll scream more. So I painted some orange on the bottom just to get some glow. Or orangish, brownish. I think that? that's you talking. Oh, that's weird. I was, shouldn't have. That's weird because I didn't have me even loaded. Oh, maybe it's something else then. I just thought it sounded like you. It does kind it's of. It's a lady. It's weird. I wonder if it's like some super long commercial that you get on YouTube because I had something running. Oh. Mm -hmm. And then it goes to. In like a full hour or something or other. 
I don't know what. Frickle is happy. Hmm. Just grabbing a little color to. Kind of keep the glow going. More glow than you need. Oh, Chase popped in with $9.99 and his goat emoji. Thank you, Chase. I super appreciate it. I wonder if he ate the soup. I don't know. You could ask him. Oh, no, I think he said he was going to have a wrap. Well, he's going to have tuna. Yeah, I thought he was going to have a wrap, maybe. All over the world knows now. Mm-hmm. Here, I'll give you a peek of what the, here, here's what we're aiming for in case you want to screenshot, here, this way probably be better, a screenshot right off the bat, in case I forget. Chase said tuna. <laughs> <laughs> tuna. You should go see what that sound is, come on. Oh, it's okay. I mean, I'm, it's okay. I don't think, I have good internet here. Mm-hmm. I don't think it'll hurt anything. She's making me sweaty anyway. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I think I tapped the mic when I got out. Oh, I wasn't going to paint the sides, and now I'm, I'm not thinking about it, so I started painting the sides. can do that off camera. Huh. Oh, how the heck did that launch? I don't know. I did... I had one of my videos running because I was looking at it and I didn't have it up even ready to go. There was a bigger window and it was just the current live. Oh, weird. I paused it. Maybe Freckle was watching you. No, I must have done something. <laughs> or we have ghosts. I must have done something. The bigger window. I was looking at... Um, uh, ortho, orthopedic doc, ortho, ortho Nebraska. Mm -hmm. So whatever, bone doctors. Mm -hmm. That's what the big window should have been. <laughs> it was YouTube and it was our live. Huh. Interesting. Okay, it's picking up as I try to keep getting color on it. So I really should just let it dry. Oh, there I kind of got coverage. Just let it dry. side. Probably trying to relax a little bit, maybe. It's kind of weird. It's a very stressful bird to paint, you know? No, yeah, that's cute! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know why. Probably just try. I wasn't breathing or something. <laughs> that sounds funny. I wasn't breathing. Oh, so I'm thinking the sun's coming from... Gosh, a little bit at the top, right? Get Mr. Sun in there. That's what we call him, right? nice about the angle brush is if you need a little round I should use an angle brush more you pretty much got it built in with the tip uh oh someone no. said they're here and buzzing no way is that black thing plugged in black. Mm -hmm. no I'm gonna I'll turn it up here oh yeah it's the same buzzing okay well we have a new splitter so it's not that Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. She didn't plug her computer. That's so oh, funny. Just, oh, no. I have to wait, the thing. I'm going to do my stand over here again. Oh, because of the delay? Mm-hmm. I think it's just the feed. And your voice is kind of cracking as you talk. Oh, should I keep talking? Yeah. So I'm using the brown here, and I'm going to just kind of keep sing-songing, talking, so Emily can check the, the buzzing. And I'm kind of getting blobs. 
not real happy about that. I'm going to paint over my toes just a little bit with the brown just to fill in the little green specks coming in. I think that works. I'm going to work on the, let that dry a bit and I'm going to work on the, on the body of the cardinal. The buzzing stopped as I'm over here, but your voice is still kind of popping. What is it? Mm-hmm. Of course, I do it when my thumb hurts, but I think those are in there. Mm -hmm. um, do you want me to keep talking? Yeah, just keep talking. I'm going to just bring my pooter. Darn, I thought it was that plug. And then we didn't have it twice, right? I know. But we've, like, I swear we've had it at the old house and stuff, too. That's why I think it's YouTube. Mm-hmm. Are these mics? <laughs> well, one mic is, well, it doesn't matter. It's newer. That's weird. Is it because I crushed the cord? <laughs> Maybe. I'm not really listening, I guess. I'm listening to us, uh, not you. <laughs> no, no. That, yeah, that's fine. I'm sorry. No. I'll, uh, and I'm not talking. So I'm, I'm kind of thinking, like, if this is a pear shape or a ball. I, I mean, I have a really strong light source. A lot of times, you might the light source might come in a little bit from the edge, but it really doesn't in the reference photo. You don't have to do that where it comes in from the edge. I'm kind of thinking I might do a little reflective light on the back side here. I don't know if that's even going to show. Maybe if I grab a little white. I get fussy. And I say it like it's a bad thing, it's, but that's also kind of what's fun for me. Go at my own pace and go with what occurs to me. I'm still not quite getting what I want there, but I think we'll leave it alone. The occasional like bubble crack when we both talk is still there, but the buzzing is gone. Then I'm over here. Okay, well, we'll go back and see if it comes back. I already moved all my things. Oh, okay, don't. <laughs> it's okay. I'm like, well, we need some sort of like confirmation. We don't have to. I mean, it stopped once I moved, but yeah. And I unplugged everything. I got unplugged me, or whatever. Um, well, that's, that's what I mean. I mean, I, yes, moving hel helps, but maybe it's just unplugging that helps is where I'm going. Oh, um, before I moved, it was still doing it. Okay. I had already, I had, um, when, cause like I had unplugged everyone when you said, oh yeah, that's what I was thinking. It was still doing it. Well, so I have a table and everything for you. <laughs> huh. Shelly says, I love the small pieces. My customers really love them too. Heart emoji. Oh, are you a full-time artist and sell your work? Your customers love them too? Mm -hmm. That's exciting. I think so. <laughs> she has designs in her username, so probably. That's exciting. What sort of things do you paint? I suppose I can go look at her uh, YouTube channel when we're done. Mm -hmm. Gail asked, is the buzzing from feedback? I don't know. I, don't know. I mean, I sit by a bunch of outlets and I'm like, I have my computer plugged in. Well, there's an outlet right there. But like there's nothing, oh, there's something plugged into it. I don't know. What well, it is over there. Nothing like, like lights. Well, I guess that is a light. Yeah, that is your a light. Your computer isn't plugged in. Oh, no, this is your smelly Cincy. Yeah, that's a light, though. Well, I was thinking I'm not next to the outlet that has the light. I don't know if that's even a thing. Um, but that's but where the, it but keeps the, happening. The Cincy thing is a light. There's a light. Oh, it is a light. I mean, <laughs> it's a I'm light. Because like, it's a candle warm or whatever. Communication is so hard no matter how clear you try to be. Hi, Freckles. Freckles like, just get it right, guys. I'm going to put a little, Hi. A little Hi. white on the cheek. Hi. Hi. She's like, you're in the wrong spot. <laughs> when she meows, she meows so big, she closes her eyes <laughs> at me. Hi. She means it. Mm-hmm. So my red-orange here is quite transparent because my yellow is transparent. I usually mention this. You can tell because the box is half full on the diagonal there. And the quinacridone is, quinacridone is the same. So that can be annoying, but you can just add a little white and then come back with the full color in a second layer. Let's see. I want this. I 
And then when it goes over the green, it gets kind of brownish, which is nice. That can be nice. Instant shadow color. You know, artists talk about mixing a rich, rich shadow, but I'm already mixing compliments just because of the transparency of the red over the greenish yellow on the background. Red and green are compliments. I'm not sure if I said that correctly. I don't know what we do about it, Em. It bugs me. That's fine. I don't get mine sitting on the floor. Do we have a break today? Yes. Okay. I didn't ask. I always forget to ask. Oh, I didn't say it that way. I just said, oh, so-and-so did this and so Oh, true. But I didn't really say, hey, we have a, a break. So when I say, I haven't said this in a while, when I say layers are your best friend, that red just needs more layers. Let it dry. You know what I might do is instead of that brown, I'm just trying to fill in little gaps I can see from the background coming through. I'm going to take a little quinacridone, which is cooler. I consider it a red. And we'll do that. So we'll get cooler over here. It'll help the cardinal look a bit more round. Well, so if it's the mics, it might be your mic, mm -hmm. because I don't get it when I do regular videos. Yeah, I'm assuming it's either my mic or the fact that we're using a splitter. And I know the splitter's new, but just the fact that we're using the splitter. Just like there's no helping it or just going to do it sometimes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I should use your mic on the next video. Mm -hmm. I can do that. I just have to remember. So brush direction will help you, or even like shape direction. Kind of shaping out the belly, the underbelly. After all that yelling, she's gonna, the cat's going to go away. I know. She's snooping. She's been smelling the carpet a lot lately. I'm like, why? Pretty much since Saturday. Someone had stinky toes. Somebody had stinky toes in my house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to glaze over the tail feathers when I'm thinking of it. Leanne says, I don't hear the buzzy. Thank you, Leanne. Thanks. We appreciate the help. Yeah. If any, The second anybody hears major buzzing like that, it's helpful if you put it in the track. Because I have the headphones on, but I listen. It's delayed, so I just turn it down really low so I can just, like, faintly hear us just to make sure that the mics are working but I don't I it's too low to hear buzzing well and I couldn't I couldn't even stand it low because you'd hear everything twice mm -hmm. I'd go kind of I'd go bonkers yeah I love the glazing fancy word for transparent paint if your paint isn't transparent then put a medium in it I, it's been a while, but I was thinking that a lot of acrylic painters use gloss medium, but I don't want the shine and no shine going on on my painting, so I use the matte medium. But I, they both, I'm sure, work just as well. There's an extender. There's a gloss medium extender, which I used ages ago, but I felt like it made my paint stickier. And I don't know that that's even true. You know, you have these impressions, and you're like, I'm not doing that again. You don't even know if you even tested it correctly, you know. I just, I got cranky with it. I know, I'm pretty sure a lot of artists use that, too. I feel bad you're all, at least you're young. <laughs> you're all folded up on the, on the floor with a folding chair. It's fine. Well, that's kind of fun. I might like that better. Leave that alone. Oh, wait a minute. I just saw like a little, what's also nice is I can go over that black mask I painted and paint right into it. So you don't have to be super neat. I'm going to lighten that up again. I think I want this cheek to be cheekier. Cool. 
cool beans. Should I keep talking a lot? Em? It doesn't. It doesn't matter. Whatever you want to do. You don't have to fill okay. the void if you. I kind of slowed down. And I realized I. That's fine. So your little lines on the wing don't have to be like. There's a bunch of them in the reference photo, and they're really nice and straight and pretty. And mine are not. You know what, I think I should use, I didn't use the angled brush on the first one I painted. I like that. Works pretty well. One tool works for both bigger strokes and smaller. Oh, Shelly um, gave a $9.99 super chat. Oh, hey, Shelly, thank, thank you, you so thank much. You. I'm going to buy some yellow paint soon. I appreciate that. You go through that yellow. I mean, I know it's because it's transparent and you mix with a lot and, yeah. you know, but... Dang, girl, you go through that yellow. I do. Thank you so much. I feel like so every much. time you tell someone you're going to buy a tube of paint, it's yellow. <laughs> Pretty much white, but yeah. most of the time yellow. Because I buy, well, I buy more. I buy two tubes of white at, at once. Yeah, when we talk, it's still kind of popping. Huh. And then one time it just went away and we don't know why. Was that true? The popping? Yeah. Yeah, when it when it... That fiasco pop of popping the day I forgot my headphones where I kept having to run out oh, of the room. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was... We, like, ran for a while without mics, and then we... Oh, that's right. Plugged them, we plugged them back in, and it was fine. I'm, I'm kind of thinking once it's time for break, I want to unplug them. I have that itch, too, but... Okay. Okay. What's nice is we don't, this isn't a cardinal pet portrait, so we don't have to worry if the details are a little off. It can be wonky. Well, well, I don't, yeah. Um, when you say wonky, what comes to mind is your structure's off. Oh. Um, but that's not what you mean, I don't think. Not that severe. I'm just thinking he doesn't yeah. have to perfectly be the picture. Like, he could be not noticeably enough wonky is what I picture. True, true. But to me, wonky, I instantly go to, oh, the structure's, mm -hmm. like, no, the structure's important. Well, unless you're doing, like, an ab, like a, an extreme would be an, a Picasso face. Or it's, I think that's cube, he's, I don't know if he's considered cubism, but it's just real wonky. And, I mean, but sometimes if you're going from, I don't know, there's a line where you want to, you're painting real enough, you want to get the structure stable. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Walk and talk and chew bubblegum. Oh, neat purple going there. Maybe I'll pull that over. I just saw a cat here. Oh, Gail gave a $10 super chat. Oh, hey, Thank Gail. You. Thanks so much. Are you going to buy a second tube of yellow paint? Um, <laughs> I, maybe I should buy two at once. Yeah, you're going to have to buy it. You bulk up. We're going to bulk up on that yellow paint. <laughs> Well, I do. Most colors, I won't want to say all of them, but what if I'm not remembering something? Yeah. You know, it takes a lot more yellow than of any other. If you're using yellow, it's going to take a lot more yellow than any of the other colors. I think in almost any brand, too. It's just not as strong of a pigment. But I hate, since I just use Liquitex, I really hate to, like, use the word always or never. Because that's what's kind of fun about art is someone will prove you wrong. You're like, I did this. I don't know. I'm just kind of looking for a not quite black. And I think it's not going to matter. I'm going to do all that mixing. All right. Am I still in frame? Yes. Oh, huh. I almost sent you a TikTok of this, um, of this older woman and she was showing her either her granddaughter or her daughter how she opens her jars <laughs> and I almost sent it to you like don't worry like we'll just eventually get you this when <laughs> you can't open jars anymore and it was this big machine that was like oh I don't not a big machine it was like the size of like a small crock pot you mm -hmm. know like 
the That's crock big, pot. though, for a jar opener. I know. And she, like, twists the top open. She's got to readjust the size so it hugs the jar. And then she twists the top back down, and then she pushes a button, and it opens her jar for her. I was like, don't worry. We'll just get you this someday. <laughs> um, right now, I can show the one my mom's. I've got my mom's sitting right here. Yeah. I, was so thinking... I, use, so I just don't have much hand strength. And now I'm starting to get some arthritis. So I've got a new one of these down in my kitchen, but this is one that might have been my grandmother's. Hmm. Edlin Company, Burlington, Vermont. Patent pending. Top off. <laughs> but I, was I thinking... love like the circus. I don't know if you guys can see the circus lettering. Oh, mm hmm Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> that might I that might I don't know. I should you know the things you should ask and remember. Uh-huh. I don't remember. But I um I was thinking, I found this, I'll have to find it and show it to you, but it was like, oh, when that, when that little thing isn't enough, we've got, we've got machines we can just kind of put on your countertop <laughs> to open your jars for you. Yeah. Um, your body, your body should just always work. What did I, oh yeah, when we had tacos or whatever, when everyone came over and we had tacos. Oh, I could I opened get... the salsa jar for you. Yep. Um... Uh, Jacqueline asks, Annie, what's your favorite bird to paint? With a little bird emoji. Probably chickens. Oh, like the like a roosters chicken and rooster. And... Yeah. The feathers would be fun on that because they're a little more like pronounced. Uh -huh. Is pronounced a word? Uh-huh. Okay, thank you. <laughs> more dominant. I told Chase about the last, was that last week? Um, we had the pronunciate. Oh, yeah. That was very clever. Chase was like, that actually makes sense, though. That should be a word. It should be a word, yeah. <laughs> he validated me. And <laughs> oh, that's so nice. Instead of giving you crap. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't remember. You, you did a great job remembering what that was. I keep painting the size. I said I'm not going to do it. I think chickens. I paint, Well, it's hard because, like, I didn't like painting necessarily any of them. And I thought, you know, I wonder, when I first started trying to sell my originals, I'm like, Oh, I, you know, birds and chicken or hens and roosters are still like evergreen in the license, art licensing world. And then they sell the best. So that's, I don't know which came first, really, the chicken or the egg. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> because I'm also practical oh. about it. I don't want a house full of art. I found it. it Black and Decker makes it. <laughs> Maybe we'll buy that. How expensive is it? <laughs> It's 150 <laughs> Oh, no. No, we'll buy paint. But it looks like the size of a little <laughs> crock pot, and it's called Lids Off by Black & Decker, and it had adjustable everything. It was... Well, and after I said that, I'm like, no, I'm not going to spend any support money on something uh -oh, personal. Oh, yeah. No. I wasn't thinking. You're just being silly. But it is 6.31 whenever you're... Oh, thank you. Usually I feel ...ready for it. a break. Or I call it a... I don't know. It needs a name. Eventually, it'll have a name, but just like the, the thank you break. It's sort of a it's, thank you break. Yeah, that works. Maybe I will just, I will now. Provided from viewers like you. Thank you. The PBS break. <laughs> it's probably an IP name that I'm not supposed to use. <laughs> probably. Um, from viewers like you. Thank you. Okay, I just want to take a minute and thank Kathy Z for sending money through PayPal. Um, I, I wrote down D Mullins because she's G.I. Jane with a reference photo, and I don't know where I stuck the reference the photo. Cardinal. Right in front of you? No, that's but it doesn't have oh. her name on it. I was looking for the one with the name on it. Oh, I thought it was... Oh. It doesn't matter. Okay. It's the reference photo. The link's in this video's description. She sh she's showed up in chat once, I think, and I think she's in the Annie Tro Art Friends Facebook group. But she has a few photos up on Pixabay, and you might like them. Um... Hi. And then Susan L., thank you for the super thanks. She uh, left it under the white hen ornament. So we painted oh. a white hen during a live not too long ago. Mm -hmm. And then I, maybe two years ago, a year ago, I did a little 4 by 4 ornament with a lime green background. Hmm. And I remember that. That's where uh, Susan left the super thanks. Mm -hmm. Oh, I wrote down a year ago. I, I had a... Oh, and I think she was... Um, that's where, she, that's where I, I read that she had mixed a brown and was excited about it. So that's oh. so fun. Uh -huh. That's so fun because it can be scary or it can be frustrating. I still do it, but sometimes I end up with really huge puddles. And I just end up almost throwing paint. I do throw paint away because I 
you know, I'm like, okay, the yellow is weak. The phthalo blue is super strong. Just use a pinch, you know, and I still forget. And then, oh, no giveaway this month. I'm getting ready. It's way off in July when I have my show, but I'm grateful to be selling my original. So I don't have any art to give away. So no giveaway this month. Boo. I know. I like the giveaways. They're fun. They are fun. I really like them. But yeah, you got to, you're selling and I'm we need inventory for the show. <laughs> yeah. And until I have enough inventory, for, well, I, no, I, I can't do that. That's too many months away. I'll figure it out. Mm-hmm. Well, and I've just been doing personal things since last June, which I want to do. Personal family things that crop up. I could say, no, I won't do that, you know? Mm -hmm. I don't want to say no. You can't say no to me. Well, you aren't you aren't one of those things that cropped up. I know, but I'm family. Yes, you are. And I, I, <laughs> you can't say no to me. I have, I can. Well, if I do, you'll just argue. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I was thinking, I was going to, I was going to go more like blackmaily, like I have to log into your channel. True. <laughs> True, you can make my life miserable. I can, I can um, post as, as the Annie artist as, if I want on Facebook. Could, you could. <laughs> you could. You even know how I talk. Oh my gosh, yeah, I could write, yeah, writing a post to sound like you, I totally could. Okay, whatever you want. <laughs> That's like when the scammers take over your computer and you're like, oh, just give me my computer back. <laughs> I'm a real life, I'm an in-person possible scammer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I made I made this one definitely juicy. Oh, I can't, it's a 20 by 20, so I can't show you. It's way too big for how close I am during the live. But I painted it, I've done this before. It's a two color painting. So yellow and brown, brown out of the tube. And then I don't, I don't count black and white as a color. Uh, and it's very mute. The whole point is it's very muted where this one's really juicy. Because every once in a while I'm like, oh, I need to, I don't want to look at the rainbow. You know? Mm -hmm. I want to change it up. I think she's going to come back. I think she is too. She's I need to pick up tonight. the pace here. I'm going to take some yellow and some of my red orange. What? She heard me call her out. So, pa yeah, painting white will make this color stand out as the color I mixed. It won't mix with the dry paint behind it, underneath it. Oh, I want to, here, let's get this on here. I want to fix something. Hi, friend. Hello. You're back again. I missed you so much. I missed you. I do you realize you're live, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I don't mind it. Use my kitty voice in front of everyone. Hi. She responds well to it, though. Well, she knows um, it means. Yeah, she knows it's her for her. Yeah. I wonder if, like, she's like, ah, I know it's for me, but it's so annoying. <laughs> Probably. She's kind of bossy. She's being fussy. I think she's going to go lay with her shoe. Oh, I said bossy, but fussy works. Oh, I heard fussy. <laughs> I think I, when I'm looking down and I'm thinking, I think I'm, I know I mumble. Yeah, she's yawning. She's tired. Oh, she doesn't stay up very long. Oh, I lifted the paint because it was starting to dry. I'll just leave it alone. See if I can get away with it down here. He's a little less chubby than you usually do. I mean, I know yeah. that's probably the reference photo you're going off of, but... Yep, yep. If I, if I, if I go to... Bleh. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of was like Porky Pig. Oh, uh, bitty bitty. Yep. <laughs> I painted a, two chickadee pals. I can't remember what I called it recently. Mm -hmm. And I drew them. So they're like round. Butler. Roundy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, and I used to do it more when even when I traced. But I'm, 
don't know. I just haven't been doing that. I do like them when they're chubby. It just means they're cold, but I, like, I still like it. I'm going to... um. I keep hearing... Is that a dove? I don't know. I think it is. Um, I'm just going to kind of come back and put in some of these. I don't know if I need to. I'm just kind of playing with... I might give this one more cheek. That's not doing anything. So I'm painting little. I like these cheap, thin brushes. Because I, otherwise I... Um, these are very nice brushes, but it's thicker. Oh boy, I'm trying to aim and see the top of my phone. Um, I really like these too, but it's it just is going to hold more paint. Mm -hmm. And I, when I'm doing a little painting like this five by five, I like I like the cheap thin ones. And I do quite a few of these because um, I don't make nearly as much money as on a big one, but I, they sell easily and cash flow is a good thing. Everybody likes cash flow. Oops, I think that'll be okay. I think I want his head to maybe um maybe come with a little. Oh, she came back out. She doesn't know what to do. I know she won't settle. Do you want to come soup in your little bed? She's seen you on the floor before. I know. I think that's bowing her a little bit, and she's. She doesn't know what to do. Oh, I just painted over my eye. Huh. I like them. A, a more of a, a personal update. I completed that hmm. thing to get the target circle rewards. Mm -hmm. oh, and I was like, if you find yourself that you need to spend. Oh, and I never made it. No, it's fine, but I did it. I, I said, I, I gave Chase the, hey, do you want to help me get? So we, so we split up like our normal grocery, but like trip into two. So we went like a Monday and then a Thursday or something. And then we did another Monday, another Thursday, and I, I was able to do it. <laughs> so you got like so much cash back, kind of. Yeah, thing? like the all the every once in a while, Target Circle will do like a spend this amount of mile, amount of money in this amount of time, and will you get like double? It's usually like forty or fifty bucks in like cash back, basically. Cool. cool. So I do that, and then when the cash when we get enough cash back is when I buy like things for the house that. Like I've got, I got our sheets with the cash back once, or I got hmm. one of our lamps with the cash back. Oh no, yeah, it's like you know, cash back on a credit card. <laughs> Literally, and... yeah. yeah. So once I get enough, the only annoying thing is that it's every just... time we go to Target, they're like, "Do you want to use your points?" And I'm like, "No." Yeah, I don't think. Oh, pardon me. I don't think I got you um, very many points with my small purchases. No, you did. I think you did. No, I well, there wouldn't be that many points or small purchases. Oh, probably. Like but better or nothing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really like their their circle situation that they have. Oh gosh! Because like our other grocery store, like local grocery stores, they have like the fuel savers. But like just Chase and I just don't get gas enough for those to be worth it, you know? Right. So I really like this, and I like the Target Circle because also Target now has Ulta attached to it. So really, as long as Chase isn't still listening, you know, I could just slip a few. Ulta purchases underneath the, the cash back. Yeah. Mm. Oh gosh, when I was buying diapers and formula back in the day. Oh, I will get. I'm gonna get oh. so much cash back I would during love that time. That. <laughs> I'll be you like hundred a week. I, well, I don't know. Yeah, I'll be like Chase. We are only buying diapers from Target just for the cash back. Well, in Target, if you don't know what that is, it's a grocery store and it's a, and it has it's a things store. It's like a Walmart but smaller. I suppose, yeah, Walmarts are more places. More everywhere. I was thinking if you're out of the country. Yeah. Um, it's like... It has clothes. It has a smaller, kitchen stuff. It has yeah. food. It has... Yeah. Smaller grocery stuff and then it has household clo uh, items, clothing. Where's that like, one? Um, Ulta's, which is like a makeup 
um, beauty supply store in the U.S. Mm. They also have a baby one in there. So I can, it's like a one-stop shop for me. Like Chase needs more socks. We just also get them when we get groceries. Oh, I would have loved that because I can't remember when it was that they, Target used to just be like a, a thing store, clothes and discount, kind of discounty. Um, oh, right. Looked, so I ended up going to the grocery store and Target for. We looked it up once because Chase was telling me that the Target, one of the Targets in town, was the first of that of the the first. What is that called? A used super to, Target. Oh well, they used to call them Target Greenland. Yes. Back when it I was, was in the Minnesota. first one of that. Minnesota. Minnesota. But they didn't even do it first in Minnesota. It was the first here. It was like the super Target. Oh yeah, maybe for the super part, the super yeah, maybe. Yeah, I, th- I figured maybe. they were the same. They're based out of Minnesota. That's where the company yeah. Is. But anyway, anyway. Yeah, people don't care. I know. I know. That's why I was like, it's just a personal thing. But I was like, I did it. Yay! I know. I didn't help you really. No, it's just like, you know, I just bad my eyelashes a little bit, and I was like, how do you feel about us breaking up our groceries <laughs> this week so I can do this? You batted your eyelashes a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Freckles. I think Freckles is starting to shed more. It hasn't been. Well, I guess it has I, she s- is. sort of been warm. Mm-hmm. I, I see more cat hair and things in my paintings. I have to pick out. Oh, geez. She just did. She totally is. Because when I was petting her today, just earlier, I feel like more hair came off. I just play with a color. I don't know. It might be too colorful for a branch. My voice. I've been listening to the tone of my voice. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay, I'm kind of, when I slow down like this, I'm kind of like at a stuck stopping point. Although this might be dry enough now for me to do it again. I'm also thinking I could put in some leaves here. So, a lot of times I might do this as a 5 by 7 and fill up more of my canvas. In order to fill up the canvas, for me, this is personal preference and taste. You could totally leave it like this. You could splatter it. If I just put in some suggestion of leaves which I think is actually kind of fun oh, and that's wet I need to I need to varnish that to protect it um, I need to step back and look at my branch here let's work on the bird oh no I'm trying to look at the live <laughs> it's like catch up My paint's getting a little sticky. I love the light brushies on his chest. Yeah, that helps. The patch of peachy brushes, brushy strokes. Oh, I'm going to go over those. I know, but I <laughs> I like them. Whoops. They'll add depth. Well, yeah, they might. They might. I, I tend to put them in, take them out, put them in. I think this would be easier to paint it a little bit bigger. Oh, I know what I need to do. I need to work on the wing. And I'll have to, I fixed his eye. I'll have to come back in and I made his eye really blue when I fixed it. Put some black in there. Black in there. That's a good, I actually could work on the, as I don't, work on the wing right now. There was a, those extra strokes are because there's a little hunk of junk. Okay. I mean, the wing could be done by just, I like this wing better. A little darker. Could work on the toes. I don't want to forget the toes. What color? Oh, maybe we could go over with a little quinacridone. I don't know if it needs a ton of quinacridone. Maybe some gray. Something cooler. I think 
Angel Anderson painted some birds yesterday? Hmm. I looked right before the live. Oh, yeah. It's That's definitely bird season. A yellow bird? I don't know what that one was. And a tufted titmouse. Of course, she lives south, I think, so she's probably definitely having spring. Mm-hmm. We're having a Midwest spring-ish when the weather just doesn't know what it wants to be. True. <laughs> it's, very, it's very on brand. It's been a little, it's definitely been warm at points, but the, from snow to warm to snow to warm to, this is kind of like spring weather that we're getting right now. Yeah, we're at the end of March though, so that makes sense. Mm -hmm. It's very, it's kind of on brand. When it was February, it was like, what? Yeah, that was weird. Jackie says, so pretty. Thank you, Jackie. Just playing with it. Oh, that's a, such a similar value you cannot tell. I can I tell my hair hits the my phone every so often. Oh, how's the crackling? I think it's slowed. I think it's it's a little bit still there, but it's slowed. I think it's so funny how much well, that bothers not, me, and I can't even hear it. it. Oh my gosh, the hair freckles. I have lint rollers everywhere. I had a sweatshirt on so my t-shirt wouldn't have a ton of hair on it. <laughs> Sometimes I keep like doing the same thing, just in different colors. Um, I might need to come back and stop being so detailed and just put a big old brush stroke in. But I think what might also help be kind of fun is to put some I'm just gonna kind of stamp. I'm kind of stamping and brushing. Let's darken some of these up, maybe. Hmm. Still not liking it. Well, I lined all these up. Pretty much those two for sure, and then those two. <laughs> There's so many things to think about. I can't. But you can go in there and kind of erase some paint over them. Okay, I'm going to work on the toes. How much time do we have? A half an hour-ish? Um, maybe black. We'll make them, I think I want them to stand out more. Some more contrast. So this is, I mean, I would, I like, a, I think I would really like a stay wet palette, which we've talked about before, but I like that I can, on a stay wet palette, it has straight up edges. I can keep creeping up that edge. Mm -hmm. Of course, if I got a bigger stay wet palette, we could not be quite so close when we do this overview, overhead. I'm having trouble seeing where I'm painting. Oh, and I, that toe just got bigger, but I think we're, I don't think I mind that. I might switch to um, the round brush. It's going to be a little, I'm just not getting a good line, and I don't think it's the brush. I think it's the artist. But I'm going to see if I can, and maybe the paint wasn't thin enough. Oh, yeah, that paint's getting. I'm just going to drop a little water in it, which could make it dry faster. I still haven't decided if I like the palette spray because I'm fighting with it clogging all the time. Mm-hmm. I'm not stinks. Yeah, I'm gonna put the fighting makes it less fun. Yeah, it does. You know what? I'm just painted out the color on those toes on this one. I'm just gonna make them black. I really lost the color, and I don't, that's not a bad thing. A lot of times I'll paint the color just to try to help my paintings have more interest and more color, but I'm not upset if it, you know, if I lose it. I think it looks a little richer. Your painting will look a little richer if you have more layers. 
Um, I saw it two galleries and some artists go quite thin. I'm sure on purpose. But I'm like, I, it's not my thing. To me, it looks like they're, I don't know, being cheap with the paint. Do you have an opinion on Emma, or you don't have to share it if you don't want to? I don't know. I love your, I love your light. I think 90%, not that you're not talented, but 90%, well, I guess you're talented <laughs> with layers. But I think, like, 90% of your painting is the layers, you know? It helps. Because... I feel like we say it all the time. Like, you could be done so much sooner, theoretically, oh, you yeah, know? Oh, yeah, that thing, yeah. But um, just the layers do so much, and they help so much, and they add depth, and, you know? Depth of color. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I just, I like it, too. But I, you're also probably biased. I mean, you yeah. see all my stuff all the time. But, yeah, I mean, if you go back to my old YouTube videos... You might like those better. They're um, flatter both in value and color. It's not like there's a right or a wrong. Okay, let's um. I don't want to. I want to make sure I have enough time for leaves. Mm -hmm. The leaves. The leaves. The sweet leaves. Next week, I think it'll be what's on my bigger easel, but and I think it's going to be a ch uh, a rooster. I could say chicken, but then you don't know if it's a hen or a rooster. Oop, I gotta be careful of my wet toes down there. Glazing takes more patience. Well, to, to do all layers takes more patience and time, which I don't know if that's smart. You know, crank out a painting in a half an hour and sell it for 500 bucks is smarter than, oh, I don't know how long that one took. I think this was a little quicker, three to four hours <laughs> for 30. I sell these for 30. So that's, you know, that's not $10 an hour. Plus the cost of the paint and the, the panel. But, I, you know, they move, people, I used to have them for more, but people, where, where I'm selling them, they wouldn't pay more for them. I kind of just kept adjusting the price until they started moving. Do I want to do that? Do I need to do that? Yeah, I don't like this. Do it again. That might be too... Another thing is, a lot of times I'll have a, a stray feather if I don't have one on here. I think I want the wing darker. I'm going to grab some straight up brown. She says with a question mark. You like that better? All right, let's put some leaves in. How are we looking? It's looking a little thin to me, too. Anything I say is just my opinion, which I know you guys know. But, I mean, there's a buyer for every artist. Opinions are like, I don't know. Do you know that saying? I don't think I do. Oh, opinions are like buttholes. Everyone has one. <laughs> Have you never heard that? No. <laughs> Have you never heard that? No. I mean, usually it's usually it's said. That's stinky. <laughs> that's usually said when someone's being like more rude. Well, that's just my opinion, and then you reply with, "Well, opinions are like the A word Butthole. for a booty." Yeah. Everyone's got one, you know. Oh, <laughs> I missed. I, if I ever heard it, I didn't remember. I don't think I've ever heard that. Oh, Melina sent a four ninety nine super chat. Hey, Melina, thank you so much. I'm playing with layers, values, warmer in the sun, cooler in the shadows. I definitely can get two of the big tubes of the yellow. 
Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, we're getting yellow paint. <laughs> we're gonna get a bucket, like a like the when you're painting your wall paint can of yellow paint. They have small like buckets. They do. Oh, jars. That's, I bet that's cute. I would buy that oh, just for the novelty. I don't think they have a handle. But still, that's cute. I'd buy it for the novelty of I'm it. Pretty sure it does come in a. I'd be that's packaging. Sometimes I'm sold on just packaging, and that would be it, you know? Yeah. It's probably so annoying to use, but I would use it. Oh, you could scoop it out into something. I just don't. Yeah. You know, I don't want to. I like, I want it to, I don't want it to take up all my storage space. I could keep it in the closet. Pour out of it. Mm-hmm. Okay. So let's put a leaf... <laughs> Elena says, enjoy that yellow, LOL. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I will. Cab yellow medium hue. I go through a lot of it. Sorry if the phone keeps moving. I feel my hair hitting it. So I'm not going to do anything fancy, but I'm just going to leave like a dark split in it. The paint's really thin, so I might have to go back over. I can see that's drying dark. Yeah, I better not do that. I'm going to rinse that brush out just in case. But I know it's wet, so I can use it as an eraser. Um, uh, Marty had said a late hello. and hey, So I, I had said something back, so that's why... I, I'm, it's kind of starting in the middle of the thought, but Marty said, I'm on spring break, so not on my usual schedule. LOL. Love the cardinal heart emoji. Spring break. Yay. Mm -hmm. I noticed that. I, um, so oh, are they here? What? Yeah. Um, oh. I noticed that because the last two, not today, but yesterday and the day before, Chase and I go to the gym over like our lunch hour mm -hmm. and there were like children and, and we go to a very tiny, like, gym. There's no daycare. So, like, I used to work at a gym that had child care. And I worked in the child care room. But um, very tiny. Technically, no kids allowed. But um, yeah, they have to be a certain age. And you have to have a membership. Oh. <laughs> but, um, and it was during, like, unstaffed hours. And there were kids in there. And I was like, <gasps> I was like, what is going on? Why are there kids here all of a sudden? Spring and then break. yesterday it clicked with me, like, oh. It's spring break. And then I checked, and I think I had gotten one of those, like, um, notices on Facebook, like, this many years ago, you po posted this, and this many, and it was when Chase and I went to Florida for spring break. Like, this time, however many years ago. It was the video of me feeding the giraffe. Oh, oh yeah, you were so excited about that. Mm-hmm. Because we couldn't do that here yet. I, I, oh, yeah, you can now. I was going to say they don't, but yeah, they do. Mm -hmm. They do it very, at very limited times here. Yeah. Probably not to overfeed them. You'd, I bet. I don't know, though, you know. I just kind of swipe till I think I like it, and then I might come back and swipe some more. To me, this is really relaxing. <laughs> just getting in the weeds. Just kind of. And sweeping, swiping. Yep. Simple. Mm hmm. Not too worried about. I have a cat here on my <laughs> lip. <laughs> I know I don't need to. Freckles has it. taken over this. Her fur has taken over this live. She's oh, yeah. screamed quite a few times. I, I love her. Oh, <laughs> definitely a short hair cat. Next time. Sometimes Next they time. sneak in. Hmm? Meng snuck in. Well, you kind of hoped with her tail. I was hoping. I was hoping that she... Hopefully Chase isn't listening. Yeah. Well, no, no. We've talked about it. Like, because Chase... I always had... Most of... Or growing up... The little, most of my time growing up has been freckle. So... Yeah. And she's like a medium, longy-ish, shared kitty. And mm -hmm. I was like, I want a fluffy kitty. And she said, no, that's so much hair. And then... Mango just snuck on in because that girl's got hair. She exploded after we started feeding her. <laughs> well, she was, what, four months old when you got her, maybe? They said 11, but I, there's no. no way. There's no way with how much they both grew and how long their tails were. They were yeah. not fully grown. I don't, yeah. 
Although, yeah, I don't know how old Freckles... We, we're talking about the Humane Society when we say they. Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know exactly how old she is. So we just decided 10 years younger than Emily. Mm-hmm. Because that would have put, put her on... I think the they were, like, she's between one and a half and two or something when we got her. So we just went, okay, two, because that's 10 years younger than me. That's an easy way to remember. Mm-hmm. So a lot of times warmer in the front, cooler in the back. I'm actually doing the, I'm doing cooler leaves in the front. Warmer in the back, you can get away with it. But if you can't decide, you can always. Of course, I'm thinking yellow sun streaked sky or something. It takes a couple layers to cover that branch. <gasps> Marty just said, my sister's cat is 29 years old. Really? Oh, my gosh. Mine have made it into the early 20s. Oh, my gosh. That is an old kitty. Yeah. Huh. I'm trying to look, picture what Freckles will be like. <laughs> if she's how old? 30? What would you say? 28? 29. 29. Basically 30. Wow. That's like the Zachary Binks of cats. <laughs> you explain what that reference is from in case they don't know. Or is it Thackeray? Is his name Thackeray or Zachary? Uh, Thackeray. Thackeray. So oh, I think that's old. That's, that's from Hocus Pocus. The yeah. Disney Halloween. channel movie, or the Disney movie from like 1991. Thackeray with, um, Binks. Bette Midler and Sarah Jessica Parker and Kathy and Kathy Jimmy. And Jimmy. Yeah. Is that how you say your name? Kathy and Jimmy. Mm hmm. But yeah. Wait, I've just worked this petal. I may need some layers to cover the branch and then I. There. Stop. Oh, and I explained who the people are. But the cat. The cat. They oh, the curse cat. the cat and then he like is a tur like lives forever. So yeah, that was the reference. <laughs> The cat get, has a, they put a spell on the cat. Yeah, he's a boy from, I don't oh, know. Oh, yeah, they put a spell on the boy, turns him into a cat. Ten cat, he, forever. He lives forever until mm -hmm. they, we won't do a spoiler just in case somebody hasn't watched it. <laughs> don't spoil the 1991 movie. Well, you know. How do I know what to do? I don't. I just like, huh, that might be fun, you know. I'm just kind of plan. I am, but I am more thoughtful about everything's pretty much, well, this isn't. This is looking away from the cardinal, but a lot of it's pointing you in. The little pointers. Gosh, the cat hair's bugging me. <laughs> okay, let's try this color again. I got to remember, I need to paint. I just picture I turn around and you're wearing like a ghillie suit of her fur. <laughs> you're just covered in it head to toe. I don't want to line these up. Like a lint monster. Oh. She shed really bad last year. Mm-hmm. And then didn't really get it back, some of it back. She's not, it sounds like she's bald. She's not bald at all. But her tail isn't nearly as thick. Mm-hmm. Um, so I'm hoping this year won't be so bad. I've been brushing her. Not a lot comes off on the brush. Hmm. I brush her almost every other day. She holds on to it to rub off everywhere. I don't know what she does. Tinker says, cute, loving the complimentary colors in this one. Oh, yeah, red and green. Hey, Tinker. I didn't mention that. Thank you for bringing that up. I'm kind of the complimentary queen. Not yeah, always. The two-color painting I've got coming up pretty soon, isn't it? I schedule it, but I can't remember when for when. I like the little V leaves. It sort of has jungle vibes, but it's it's just kind of hinting. It's kind of fun backgroundy, well, textury. Bef before um, she's GI Jane on Pixabay, did all the blurring and stuff. I think there might have even been some leaves back there. Mm -hmm. Maybe some decent sized ones. I'm not sure. Sorry about the arm, guys. Nope. We got 20 minutes. Okay. Um, let's.
give this one a little more juice. Another layer. I can tell my paints are really wanting to dry because I'm getting little lumps and chunks. And it's why I don't use a glass palette because then I pick up the dried bits. A lot of times with the styrofoam, oh, here I didn't go on the bottom. The styrofoam plate, it'll soak in just a little so I get less of the dried bits, which I like. The dried bits. Dried bits. You could paint thicker too if you don't want to go back over. But sometimes I don't, it's going to dry a half a shade darker. Jacqueline, I, oh, sorry. Nope, go, go uh, ahead. Jacqueline says, have to go, love the colors, and the cardinal is super cute. XX. Thanks so much. Thanks for hanging out with us. Mm -hmm. Thanks for hanging. Have a good rest of your night. I guess. I believe Jacqueline's far, far away. Probably going to sleep, oh. if I remember correctly. Yeah. <laughs> Have a good sleep. I think you if are. If I'm correct. <laughs> yeah, I think it's really late. Um, what am I going to do? I think we'll put in some yellow, light yellow. So I still have the habit from when I used to do watercolor of two water containers so that you have a clean one and a dirty one. But I just like it because eventually, especially when I do the lives, my water gets much dirtier because I just, I'm not, a, I'm better, much better at multitasking, but it's mm -hmm. still a challenge for me. Um, the water gets dirtier, but I just like having that clean water um, in case I really have a brush issue or something. Smart. It's more of a watercolor thing. A lot of um, painters just have one water. Or a lot of like oil. Not oil wouldn't have water. Acrylic painters. Mm -hmm. Or maybe they do. Or maybe it's like solvent. Some sort of solvent they have a bucket of. Mm -hmm. I'd buy that. What you're saying. Feels yeah, I've, so factual. I've never oil painted. Uh, Gail says, I like this better on the wing. Oh, okay. Thanks. And Leanne says, adorable cardinal, exclamation mark, exclamation mark, with two heart eye emojis. Thank you, thank you. You can tell when I kind of pause it, my brain isn't keeping up. I keep hitting my phone with my hair. <laughs> I don't know why I think his beak needs lightning. I don't know. I still don't like his chest. But you know what? His chest is not great on this one either. It's just kind of messy loose. I get hung up sometimes, or sometimes, quite a bit. I get hung up quite a bit. I think he's probably okay, and I just need to leave him be. What's nice is we have a decent puddle of paint. Even though I'm not going to use all that paint, I can poke into it and get wet paint. Hmm. Melina says, I have a three-section water basin. Oh, I've um, seen those. Like having one for clean water. Yeah, I like having a clean. But I also like it because I used to do the watercolor. Mm -hmm. There's a few watercolor videos on YouTube. I have a watercolor booklet that has some of the in-person classes I used to teach. They have step-by-step -step photos. Um, I think I have four watercolor videos. I, I've got enough to do a whole nother booklet. Just like when. <laughs> when. And some people say I shouldn't have a watercolor channel and an acrylic painting channel. Those that are YouTube experts. But mostly it's just when I just haven't, I just don't get to. It's not on my list. I think my palettes look pretty much the same by the end of most of my paintings. So I use primary colors. I really, I mean, I used to have, I still have quite a few tubes of paint, but I really pared down. 
Because I use primaries. Well, I'm, I'm considering quinacridone a red. I use primaries a lot. I think it saves money. Well, and I've been using basics a lot. The phthalo blue green shade. I, say, I think I've said this several times lately. I don't know if it comes. I don't think it comes in the basics. It might. I just haven't found it. Okay, so let's put in like some, um, like a little action blob. So even though I, I get nervous when I do this, you try to fake the confidence and it looks good. <laughs> that makes sense. I'm going to. And then the paint's a little thicker. I don't know if you can see that. I can barely see the top of my phone. It can help, for lack of a better word, that helps sell your painting. I like that you do that too. It feels like a little extra thought. Fake the Which is probably a part of your, um, you know, help sell the painting. Both. It's yeah. both. Just kind of, that one got weird. Marty says, I was using that color in a painting today. A pa in a painting I started today. Oh, the phthalo blue green shade, I assume. Mm. Neat. I like it. I like it. I like it. Maybe if I say it one more time, I like it. It's strong. A lot of artists don't like the phthalo blues because they're strong. You have to say it like that, too. I usually paint a little on the side just to... Because people look. Let me sit on a shelf. Oops, I just stuck my finger in one. I got paint on my pants. I don't know how I did it. I think it was on my hands. <laughs> you did, yeah. Because I, when I went, I don't know what point yesterday, because I wore the same pants as yesterday, um, I had paint on the side of my hand. I'm like, I did not. I don't usually do that. Mm -hmm. A little alcohol. Rubbing, spray rot, rubbing alcohol on it, let it sit, it'll come out. Uh, hand sanitizer has alcohol in it, that'll work. I think it looks like a party too when I do like little blobs of color and paint. And, you know, it does bug me, I say it doesn't bug me, but it does bug me a little bit when the, it's at this stage because I'm also breaking off pieces of this thing into my palette. They're so cheap, I like cheap. Cheap. Free would be great. Free 99? Free 99. I mean, that's why I like the giveaways. It's, they're free 99. <laughs> I love free 99. Um, Melina asks, I have not found the green shade in basics. Wonder why? Oh, well, maybe they don't do it. Because I'm, I'm thinking that's why I keep buying the heavy body. Probably. <laughs> yeah, I just can't remember because I you know, don't buy it that often. Mm -hmm. It doesn't take much to mix a color. So I don't go through it very fast. Not like that yellow. Okay, where do I wanna? I kinda wanna, now I'm nervous. I think I'll sign it here. I'll just buy myself some time there. <laughs> All right, let's just do it. Ooh, that was strong and dark. Let it rip. Oh. Oh. Well, one way I to... I don't mind it. I don't I mind could, it. I could also... Just put a second one in and mm -hmm, I don't mind Put it. a couple in someplace else. Or like darken that. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see if we can make it work. Under pressure. Can I do that? That's probably copyright. I don't like that. It's too strong. Looks like a thought bubble. Hmm, that was a better way for I messed with it. You can get yourself in so much trouble. All right, you guys, I just don't like it. It's the value more than the color. It's the strength of it. I think that's better. Let's, um... I really should have painted them a little bit more differently. 
But since I didn't, I'm mostly just talking to myself as a reminder. Um, one gallery doesn't like it when they look very similar, mm -hmm. even though they're originals. Mm -hmm. um, what do I want to do? What color? Uh, but I just have to remember to take them at different times. Don't take them to the gallery both at the same time. Do I want to? So I just dip the end of my brush, the handle. Where? Try not to line them up. I almost line, line those up. I kind of want to put one over here somewhere, but where? I did it. I made a decision. I might be about done. Is this one too weak? Here, I need to look at the stream. Oh, you can tell I'm warm. My hands are red. I saw it in the stream. Oh, it's not bad. It's coming off. Maybe. I'm getting picky. I bet you they don't. I'm thinking about the thalo blue green shape. But it doesn't come in the basics. Probably not, yeah. If Melina hasn't found it and you haven't found it. Yeah. Well, I know I've said this a bunch of times. I, I moved more towards the basics during the pandemic because I just couldn't find some things. The heavy bodies are nice and creamy if you like that feel. You can thin them out. They may go further. I'm, I, what just ran through my head is you should just stop. You can overdo it. That's still too strong. Did you see how that dried down because of the dark color underneath it? Maybe you can't see it in the video. What color did I use? I don't remember. Let's just grab. Oh, I got a hunk of junk. Really try to do it in one stroke. Not liking it. But sometimes life doesn't cooperate. All right, I'm not liking any of that. Let's see here. Melina says, "Do you think in basics?" Let's see. Sorry, there's a little frick, a little heart always gets in my freaking way. Okay, let's see. <laughs> um. I said it's a little anger, people. <laughs> always there. It's like always over like two. No, I know. Occasionally I look at the at the live stream. I don't look at it very often. And then you're, it's the last comment in the heart. The heart option is right over it. I know. Okay. So Melina says, do you think in basics it would take more ingredients to make? I, um, I don't know is the short answer. My guess is there's just more medium in it. Because the website says they're they're not as heavily pigmented as the heavy body. So I'm assuming there's just more uh, acrylic-based medium, the acrylic part. We're really, like, poppy crackling. Oh, no. Oh, do you think they could hear me? It's... Okay. Melina can let me know if that made sense. Okay, there. I think it's calmed down. Uh, and Marty says Basics has that color you can get at Michael's. Okay, I look at Michael's. I'll look again. Maybe my Michael's just doesn't carry it or... I'm really just asking for trouble. Oh, and I probably pulled off frame. I'm really asking for trouble here. Playing around a dot. <laughs> Don't do what I do. Do as I say. This feels a little light and wimpy to me. I guess it is on this one, too. Guys can vote in the comment which one you like better. Right or left. And you don't have to if you don't want to. This one's actually darker, but my light yellows aren't showing up as well. Or is it the glare from my light, maybe? Oh, I just ran over your sun. No! I looked for the sticker again. I do not know where I stuck it. The new sticker that I bought. Yeah. I think 
it's okay. Oh. I mean, not the sticker, but the... I'm looking at the painting values. So I'm gonna, what, what I'll do, I'm not doing a live stream. Well, I'll do it after the live stream. I will um, stand them up and look at them. See what I like, see what I don't like. Oh, this is the done one. <laughs> and we're They're... popping again. Gail says left. Oh, oh, thank you. It, well, if you're popping again, it's not the location. It's not that. It's not the buzzing. It's like oh. our voice crackling, whatever popping was just getting worse. Oh, okay. Um, I'm going to put another layer on these. Oh, Melina says, but not the green shade, just thalo. Oh, yeah, I have thalo blue in the basics. You can make a green. You just add some yellow. I really don't need to buy that thalo blue green shade. It stood up to, like, unplug, and then it stopped again. <laughs> Yeah, Melina says gurgling. <laughs> Gail says the new one. You flip flopped them. <laughs> I did. The silly face emoji. <laughs> I did. Okay, thanks. I know which one you mean. I did. I made it hard. I'm about done here. Yeah, it sounds like we're like um, a good description of it is like sounds like you're like going like you have mouthwash in your mouth and you're trying to talk oh. over it. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah. I don't like that. I don't know what to do about it, though. I think I need to stop. I'm not improving it. That's how do you know when to stop? We don't think you're making it better. I still don't like that one. No, oh, when I oh when I look at the stream, I don't mind it at all. Here, let's do a screenshot. I love him. Yeah, he's sweet. It does change it. Um, I've had some people say like, I can't get your brown, and I'm like, and I, I like you can't even see the brown because my phone's gonna change the color that I'm videoing with. Your phone, your TV, your tablet is gonna shift the color a little bit. So, I mean, I can kind of help you, but I don't know if you're seeing a pinker version or a yellow. You know, I just can't tell. Mm -hmm. You know, and it's, I feel bad, but I don't, there's nothing I can do about that. It's just the nature of devices. It's like walking into a TV store. They still look different. Some of them are so saturated with color. Mm -hmm. That really, oh, yeah. that, that doesn't bother me so much, Mary, but boy, did that bother me when that first came out. Yeah. The golf course and the grass was just sickening green. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Ugh. Yeah. Um, I remember when we were buying TV, like, for the house when we were getting TVs and Chase's, or, and they were talking about, like, well, this one's 10 bajillion K, and Chase is like, well, we don't, like, we just stream, and, like, we watch Netflix, you know, Hulu. And unless you pay extra money, I think only, and maybe not all of them do it. Like, you can't even stream in 4K unless you pay extra money. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's so true. So there's no point in buying the that's true. the biggest, the sassiest, the... Well, there could be if you like, I mean... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you're doing all that. But, but for you, there was no point. Yeah. I still don't like that one, even though it looks good on the stream. I'm just going to warm it up a little. Glaze some yellow over it. I'm getting picky, people. Hmm. Gail says there seems to be many videos on YouTube addressing the cap crackling slash popping. Oh, really? Huh. Mm -hmm. Do I get to be right that it's YouTube? That it's YouTube and not us? Oh, Gail, I'm rarely right. Gail. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to quit playing. Thanks. That was a help, maybe a helpful comment. I have. I don't. Well, I watch some YouTube, but not a ton. One of the guys is actually a YouTuber. He helps you people who do YouTube, and he's got a whole setup. He uses Streamyard. You know, I think it saves him a lot. Okay, I'm gonna save my palette. I always save my palette. 
um, until I that's this was just glass cleaner cleaner it's water now and then I I I still don't know if I like it but I don't dislike it other than it clogs it was misting the first day now it's more of a stream hmm. and I keep trying to mm -hmm. it just I'll figure it out I need to maybe run under some hot water like you would a hairspray bottle but I, I'll save my palette until I um, at least get a gloss. I put a gloss varnish on my paintings. Uh, if you're using removable varnish, then it's a uh, protective isolation layer. So if they remove the varnish, mm -hmm. you know, they'll start to see the gloss go away and then they know that they're removing too much. It'll help protect your painting. I do it because this one guy on Jerry's Artorama's YouTube channel did it ages ago. And he thought it gave the paintings more depth and color because you get a little bit more light bouncing back and forth in there. Hmm. Um, I don't know if you can see that. Go ahead. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. No. Um, Gail asked if we were using a window system. No, we're st we stream straight from my iPhone. The iPhone. Oh, we have a... But if you find anything, comment. Once this video's done, you can link a comment below, too. If you find, like, a... Whatever you're looking at and you find, and then maybe that'll help us. Yeah, I mean, you know, no pressure. But if you just... Yeah, if yeah. It just obviously, works you, yeah. Out, if, you, if, you have, if it works out, you don't have a job. You know, but yeah, no, we just use my phone because it's... I already have it, you know. It mm -hmm. doesn't cost us anything. If we did um, StreamYard, or I don't know if there's other programs, we could do it on the laptop, but then we've got to, you know, wire things a little differently we need. We need cameras. Mm -hmm. I mean, we might get there someday. Yeah. We got to figure out the static first because Emily keeps moving around this little studio. <laughs> yeah. And maybe if you weren't swimming in so much yellow paint, you know? Yeah. Oh, and you're on the Apple computer. <laughs> Not that it matters. But... Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys. I'm looking at the, the chat. Thanks so much for hanging out with us. I really love it. It's It just it means the world to me. It's fun. Wednesdays I get to talk to things. humans. I, 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 this isn't a pity thing, but just as an artist, you spend a lot of time alone, which I also enjoy. But um, it's really fun to have art friends. I, I super appreciate it. Now I don't know how to say my ending. Well, Marty says, great job. Have a great week. And I will see you all next week. Hey. Just squeeze it in there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you too, Marty. Um, great big. Uh, no, thanks oh. for hanging out. Is oh, that what okay. I usually do? Thanks for hanging out with us. Yeah. Melina Super says, appreciate your support. Melina says it looks great. Enjoyed watching. Oh, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> I just said Melina says it looks great. Enjoyed watching. Oh, thank I'm just you, cramming thank them you. in. <laughs> um, great big happy art hugs, and I hope to chat with you soon. Bye, guys.